Okay, we're going to start in the loaded position. At this point, knees bent looks good, back leg straight, want to see that. You can tell your shoulders are turning a little with your arm going behind your back. Oh, we talked about that. You come down at the six o'clock position. Want to make sure you're starting to get your knee up, which it looks like that. Let that heel up a little bit higher so you're pushing forward. Glove looks like it's extending. Here you go to Superman. And at Superman, you need to push a little stronger. Getting that knee in line with the hip. Almost like you're pushing over a cone. See her cone? She's over. 12 o'clock, you're nice and long. But you want to make sure your weight's slightly back. And you're a little forward. At plants, you definitely start to lean forward. You can see that she's back. The downswing, you want to drive your arms, which you do. This back leg's got to drive through. Your foot's facing the opposite way. It should face towards your target. Okay, let's get back to this position. At release, shoulder, hip, and knee end should be in line. And your shoulder, hip, and almost there. Back leg needs to come through quicker. At finish, you want to stay firm on this left side, dragging all the way through. You can see she drags through. You kind of hop out, walking through it. Don't want to do that. You want to hold this position. From the front view, This is where that back swing too high, pulling off the power line. Then you come away from the power line where you should be extending up and out. Then you get away from your ear, your arm will go behind your back. That's something we definitely want to work on. When you come through, sticking that butt out, you want to pull your butt in, shoulders back, having that back leg drag as quick as you can. Finishing nice and tall. That was actually a better one. Okay, so we just gotta work on that push and downswing a little bit. Thanks.